we're going to uh, draft O-line early, okay? So let me – so this – when and I say early, and the reason why I say this is because they're – just kind of like the reasoning on why uh, I'm not uh, saying uh, on why it's the same reason for the cornerbacks. It's because there's not a lot of O-line, like good O-line options out there. And that to me is when I was looking through the free agents and I, and let's keep in mind, this is prior to cuts. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, cap casualties, like, you know what I'm saying? Like the, from what I've seen, like just players scheduled to be free agents uh, this off season, there's not, there's nothing that gives like gets my nipples hard. Like it literally is just <laughs> meh. And like, like you get what I'm saying. So to me, Alex, to me, this is where, and honestly, we need this is where we need to make this flash at because if we're like, because no matter <laughs> what anyone thinks. Right now, I would say it's 95%. It's 95, like I'm almost 95% positive that we're going to have a new quarterback on our center this year. 95%. Okay. And so um, we need some, we need an offensive line. We need someone, and I already told you, like <clears throat> we need at least four. It, so let's, like, like and I, I, I'm probably exaggerating on four because what we still have Leno on the team. So yeah. let's say three. We need three more players on this offensive line. Mm -hmm. Starters, not mm -hmm. like actual starters. Mm -hmm. And we need so, – and so to me is we need to get that in the draft. Tell me what you think, bro. Yeah. Uh I agree with you. Um, I don't know if you want to go in free agency and and I mean it all depends on how young these guys are. Um, I know Tyron Smith um uh, from Dallas. I mean Dan Quinn, you know, he might have a connection with that. So I don't know. Um I I know I know he plays left tackle, so he would take uh Leno's spot, right? So or or does he play right tackle? He plays right or left, I forgot, but oh. um uh who? Uh Tyron Smith, the the big guy. I know he's I know he, Yeah, I know he's I know he's 32 or something like that, but the teams will probably take it. I I'm sure the man's still talented. Um uh Dan Quinn might have a little connection with that. Who knows? I don't know, but you would have to get rid of Leno, if anything. But if you get rid of Leno, we already talked about that. You know, it, it would definitely save us some cap. But I don't know. To me, you're right. I would definitely go in the in the draft and uh and get some guys, man. Uh, this is this right here. Um, is very, very important, um, especially for our franchise quarterback that we will be getting at number two, it seems like. So um, we cannot mess this up. You know what I'm saying? We have to get this right. So if we do get a guy out of free agency, it's got to be like that. Like I said, a splash, uh, a splash guy um, that we're going to pay a lot of money for a young, talented guy that that is ranked real good at center, at left guard. One of these guys. I don't I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Um but right now, what I'm looking at in free agency with Tyron Smith, uh, he's ranked 14 uh, coming into free agency, and that's and that's lineman. So I don't know if they would pay that. Um, but if you can find some a lineman that's ranked top, you know, top five in free agency, and he's in free agency, we might want to talk about that. We might want to grab that up. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, mostly my guys that I would do, I'm like you, Ab. I would want to get young guys in the draft. So and 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 again, we have five picks in the top hundred, right? Yeah, one top one hundred two. Yeah, yeah. So I would definitely at 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 in our second, we got two seconds and two thirds. So uh, one of those seconds, I would definitely go offensive lineman, and one of those thirds, I would definitely go offensive lineman. Absolutely, no question. 